this is our England. Really? Ours? Okay, I'm gonna look for me then. <clears throat> me and you, where are we? Let's see if, just a quick little glance. Let me see me and you in there. Are you in there anywhere? Can, can you see yourself? Are you there? I can't see you. I can't see me. But it's ours. It's ours. Yeah. Okay, let's start, right, with what, what we, th what they calling us. Oh, by the way, did you notice the date? Thursday. And today I got it. Friday. So what's the point of that? It's old news, isn't it? All right, you're giving me this old news for free. Toilet paper. Let's see what's in the toilet paper to coin uh, Gerald Solenti. Someone who is awake. Oh, look. Yep. Oh, look. I mean, some of these people that have got a... Jamie Oliver. Why have they put him in there? He's got a nice big picture. You, you'll tell how important they are to the system by the bigness of the picture. Yeah, Jamie's stuck to the... The horrible school dinners, didn't he? That, that vile stuff that they're giving kids and the GMO and all that. Well done, Jamie. But they're, they're claiming he's one of them. Maybe he is. Well, they just like to put people's faces in there. I wonder if they asked everybody whose face is in here to put it in here. Do they like this stuff? Anyway, moving on. Um, yeah. What? Both of them. Yeah, he's... Yeah, he's... He, he doesn't even play cricket anymore does he so you know Pippa Pig Pippa Pig's in there but you're not don't forget Wallace and Gromit I'm gonna go around and see him you know what I mean this is our England I want to knock on his door and say hey how you doing mate not even the, the creator Nick Parks no he's not in there the guy who spent millions of years in his bedroom click click clicking to actually make that no 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 it's the actual uh, fiction that we want you know, along with the the guy who's got um, all the brains in the world, I suppose. He knows everything. Look at the computers plugged into his mind. Oh, dear. Ah, shut up, you yes, yeah. yeah. Chris Evans, hey! Oh, Harry Potter, the young Harry Potter. What the hell's he holding? Um, oh, yeah. yeah. He's a decent director, but... Hey... Eagle. What? Wait. What? What is he? Hey. Hi. Oh, well, Hail. Hi. Hail. Hi. Is that his arm or your arm? Anyway, it's all a puppet. Yeah. Yeah, poor neck. Hey, Cliggy. Cliggy. Next to who? Oh, him. Yeah, 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 yeah. He can say any racist comment he likes. Yeah, he can say any racist comment he likes. Because he drives fast cars. Mm, that's how loud. Mm. Yeah, he must have got buttered up for that one. Oh, look. All the leaders are in there. So-called leaders. Simon Cowell. You've nicked your, he's nicked your hairstyle. Mm, dizzy rascal. Yep. Who the hell? You know. Oh, Brucey. Oh, come on now. I kind of like Brucey. Now, by putting Brucey in with you lot, you've kind of made me th think differently now. It's like all these other... I, I wonder if Savile's in here somewhere. I wonder if Savile in our England. Eh? Is, is Rolf Harris in our England? You know? Is, is Stuart Hall knocking it out in England? Eh? Anyway. You know, I, I, I don't know if Brucey would like that. Uh, Bowie. Yeah, oh, look, 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 yeah, yeah. I mean, blonde, not Bond, blonde. Hey, dear. Uh, you got Beckham, and you notice the way they've organised this, the two babies, it's it's, it's like a, a gathering of babies, a, a, a gaggle of babies. I, I, I don't know if Del Boy's trying to sell uh, David his baby back or what, but, you know, it's like, uh, we got the... the here, here we have the, the, the rich people's royalty, and then we have the poor man's royalty and their royal baby. Um, <clears throat> with a candle in the wind, you know. Hey, I wonder if Diana's in here. In our England. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. See. Oh, look. It's Camilla. <laughs> yes. 
And he's got a big carbuncle hanging from his ear. Looks like an earring, doesn't it? But anyway, the bi a building's in there, but not flesh and blood. No, the building is more important. This is our England. You know, and there he is, Mr. David Attenborough. Yeah. Oh, he, 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 he's, he's so scientific, isn't he? Because he gets to go around spending lots of money flying to places and filming stuff. And I'm sure nobody in the world could ever do that job, could they? I couldn't do it, could I? No, no. That's why he's come to the conclusion that there's too many of us. Because he goes into these isolated places where no one body is. And there's, just, there's too many people when I come back. There's too many people. And, we, and he says that he thinks we should get rid of some of the people. So I'm like, well, you first, David. Oh, there's the other David. Yeah. I wonder, you know. Oh, you're not Im as important as Wayne Rooney. Don't you know that? He's got money. Yeah. And there she is, the queen. She she must be massive. Have you seen the size of her compared to everybody else? She she must be at least 18 feet tall. Where the hell? She, I didn't know she was a giant. He's laughing his head off. Come on, Mick. You're taking a Mick, aren't you? Oh, there's the Beatles. Oh, look! Yay! Someone who, you know, comes from another country, but, you know, because they're a winner, um, they're English now. They're from England. You know, and they, uh, they got in through the Ministry of Silly Walks. You know, and that's where they got the passport. Come on. Stephen Fry, he's all right. He knows about common law, you know. It's got nothing to do with being gay, you know. It's, it's got to do with be, having... It's common sense and knowledge. And he's all right. He's got knowledge. And we've got the roses in the corner, haven't we? The roses with the, you know, to keep it all bordered. But, you know, let's have some dead people. Anyway, let's put some um, people that aren't even alive. What, What's really weird is that they had a face here, but it's been pixelated out. But that's England. Maybe that's you. <laughs> Maybe it's me. Maybe they just... The artist was off that day. Who knows? You know, Joanna Lumley. Wow, she was on TV just the other. Never. You know. Let's talk about the stuff that's recent, eh? Hippin' heck. You know, some of these people you may be familiar with or you may not be familiar with. But, like, they're in there, but you're not. And you know why they're in there? Because they've got money. And so, therefore, what they're saying is, our England is just about people who make money for us and for the country. We, we're we not even interested in you. We'd rather be interested in fictional characters like, you know, the Teletubbies. That's more important than you. You're not in there. You have not created no infrastructure. What are you talking about? You go to work, does nothing. It's meaningless. Don't you understand how meaningless you going to work is? Because you're never going to be a Teletubby. Right. And you're never going to be Pippa the Pig or, you know, Wallace and Gromit. You're, you're real. You could never be a fiction like the rest of these. These are all fiction people. These are people that have been given a status of fiction. And you're worshipping them. Yay, look. Look us two. Hi, hi. We've had a baby. Nobody else had a baby ever. You, you're not a baby. You was never a baby. You were just born a full-grown adult. And we're special. Look at our special clothes. We get all the money and we can have everything we want for our babies. Meanwhile, we're going to cut money for people with babies. Aren't we? Yeah, do you think he had something to do with it? Craig Charles, look at you, you're in there, mate. Hey, eh? managed to find your way off Red Dwarf and into the elite. You know? Oh, yeah, yeah, bit of Coronation Street. <clears throat> Not gonna die from that show. No, it's been on for three billion years. Bloody hell, you know? psychological brainwashing of a nation just basically you're not important you have to get your life and live it vicariously through the achievements of others you achieving anything is not allowed that's why mr bean is really really small because he said something the other day that they didn't like him to say and even though he's up there and he's made the money you get shrunk down mate you get made to the size of a p on the front page because free historic it's his it's history the, the, what did they say in 1984? People writing history, right? Historic edition for 22 million homes. Woohoo! So, so they can tell you that you are not the elite. 
You're not important. Nobody's concerned with what problems happen to you today. They're not asked, you know. This is what you should spend your whole day thinking about. All these different... Oh, here he is. Oh, yes. Put his foot in his mouth. Oh, Vic Victoria Beckham. Why is she not stood next to her husband? If that is Victoria Beckham, she looks a bit weird anyway. You never know these days because they take so much plastic surgery. They don't look like themselves. You know? Or, or... Do these people all have something in common? You know, do they share a, a common interest, a common secret even, maybe? Who knows? Maybe they know something. But all I'm saying is, listen, this is not our England. That's your England. This is what you want people to look at. Yeah, and say, non, nothing you're doing as, the, as a normal human being is important because you've not achieved what these people have achieved. But have they achieved anything by themselves? Or has it all been with help? Right? It takes, right? This is value for money. This is proof of value for money because it takes at least 60 to 70 million people to support all of these. You know? So give yourself a pat on the back because if you weren't paying for their lifestyle, they wouldn't be rich. So that's it, basically. Go on. This is our England. Is it X? It's your England. You, you you put a spelling mistake on there. You use the word our because you want it's like New World Order, isn't it? You want us to believe that life's okay just so long as the rich and famous are doing okay. You are so out of touch. It, it, it's, it's, you're not even tangible. You must be a spirit or a duppy or something. You must be a ghost because that's how out of touch you are. You're not even in the physical domain of the world. You're not even in the realm of reality. You give me a paper late. Oh, Boris Johnson. Yeah. What's he doing in there? Come on. Hey, our England, Mr. Stumblebum. Ooh, oikes. What are you doing now? Maybe, maybe, maybe um, Del Boy put this one together. Who knows? You know, you got you got big wreaths of flowers and foreigners and dead people that are no longer alive. But that's England, you know. There and fictions. All these fictions and non-living people are actually, in fact, more important than you, and have done more for the country than you have. They'll say, "Oh well, that's an export," and and therefore, what they're really telling you? What are they really telling you? History can only be made with money. That's what they're telling you. They're telling you that if you haven't made the... If, if they haven't given you an opportunity to then go and make the money. Because anybody could make money. It's only two and two, isn't it? Two plus two equals what? Four, right? And you add another two, it's going to be six. If you double and you double and you double, then you're going to get what? <coughs> Riches. So, that's all that's going on. They're not special people. And if for half of them, you've got rid of afterwards like 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 eddie the eagle <clears throat> you know what i mean he's had to struggle he had to pay for his own thing to get there you didn't believe in him and now you want to put him up there like he's one of you it's all fake this is all fake because the amount of royal people in there that is bleh. you just want to make people sick or what what's going on this is our ring oh she's such a good person is the queen well what's her oath What's her oath? To preach the gospel of Jesus Christ. Well, I want to see that daily. I want to see value for money. And I want to see how she, what her rhetoric, rhetoric is. I want to see her as a peacemaker. I want to see her up front like Christ was, yeah? Telling people. Not wearing fancy hats. That's got nothing to do with Christ, them, yeah? It's got nothing to do with the gospel. Wearing fancy clothes and having lots of money. It's all a con, isn't it? So... I'd like to speak to every single one of these, in fact, individually and interview them all individually, right? If they think they're, they're part of England, come to England then. Come to the real England, because you're not living in England. You're living in fiction land. It's all fiction. That's what it is. And they're trying to, <clears throat> I don't know, make you feel like you're a part of this. Do you really feel a part of it? Ask yourself, do you really feel a part of it? Are you are you getting any any of the perks that these people get? And what are perks? It's you paying for it. Have to take that. Yeah.